You know that moment when you go to your computer and your heart sinks. Because where do you even start with the chaos of all of these photos? It can feel like a full-time job just keeping things organized. But what if you didn't have to do it all manually? In this video, I'm going to show you how to automate your photo sorting using a few simple tools. Ones that can take your disorganized photos and turn them into a beautiful tidy folder structure with barely any effort from you. And if you stick around with me to the end, I've got a bonus tip that will help you stay organized going forward without having to think about it again. Start with a solid folder structure. In order to be able to find your photos quickly, we need a solid folder structure. I recommend setting up your main photo library with a consistent folder hierarchy that reflects time. I personally love using the year-month structure. So 2023 and then 2023-01 for January, 2023-02 for February, 2023-03 for March, you get the idea. The idea is that your photos will get moved into folders that match when they were taken. This makes it so much easier to browse and find and use your photos later, whether you're printing them, sharing them, or creating an album. You could create this structure manually, but there are apps out there that will do it for you automatically. Magic! Mac users use Big Mean Folder Machine. Now, if you're on your Mac, one of my favorite tools is the Big Me and Fold Machine. Yes, it's actually called that. The app lets you move or copy photos into folders based on the date the photo is taken using the metadata built in every image. It's amazing. Here's how it works. Open the Big Me and Folder Machine and choose Split Files into Multiple. Select your source folder. This is the folder where your messy unsorted photos live. Select to split into hierarchies. Select your hierarchies to be sorted by year and then a custom version of year and month. Then select the destination folder where you want your nicely organized photos to go. Select to see a preview, review the summary, then hit continue and watch your folder fill up with your beautifully organized photo folders. The best part, this tool doesn't alter the image. It simply moves or copies them to the right place for you. PC users use PhotoMove. If you're on Windows, don't worry, we have a brilliant alternative. It's PhotoMove. It's just as clever. It scans your photos for EXIF data. That's the information embedded inside each image that includes when it was taken. And it automatically sorts them into folders based on that date. Simple. Here's how to set it up. Open PhotoMove. Select your source folder where your unsorted photos are. Then choose your destination folder where you want your beautifully sorted photos to go. Click find photos to see what you have. Then for the output folder structure, select year and month. Select where to put duplicates and where to put files with no dates. Then select to move to destination. Just like that, Photo Move sorts your images for you. You can use the free version to get started or go for the paid version, which gives you more control and file renaming options. The choice is yours. Cloud-based sorting with OneDrive. Now, if you're more of a mobile first organizer or prefer using cloud storage, don't worry, you've still got an option. OneDrive will automatically sort your photos into folders if you've set up the backup correctly. If you're using Microsoft OneDrive on your phone, open up the OneDrive app. Tap your profile icon, then go to settings and camera uploads. Make sure you turn on camera uploads. Now, here's the trick. Turn on to organize by date in the settings in the camera uploads. Now, if your photo collection is a bit of a monster and you're thinking, Amanda, I'm just totally overwhelmed, I'm going to need more help. Then you might want to check out my Photo Mess to Success courses. They are my step-by-step -step guide to getting all of your photos into one place, decluttered, sorted, and ready to enjoy. If you're ready to find out more, then visit photomesssuccess.co.uk and I'll help you make sense of the photo mess. Right, let's wrap up with one last tip. Bonus tip, set up a photo inbox for ongoing sorting. Now here's my bonus tip, the one that really makes automation sustainable long-term. Create a dedicated folder called something like photo inbox. This is where all your new incoming photos go, 
whether they come from your camera, downloads, phone transfer, or cloud service. Then once a week or once a month, depending on how many photos you take, run your sorting tool, Photo Move, the big new folder machine, on that folder. This means you'll always know what's sorted and what's not, and you'll never have to worry about accidentally sorting things twice or losing track of what's backed up. It's like having a mail tray for your memories. And once it's empty, you'll feel amazing. So there you have it, how to sort your photos automatically into folders so you can find every photo quickly and simply. And if you're ready to finally get on top of your entire photo collection, then check out my Photo Mess Success courses, which you can find out more about in this little video here. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more photo organizing tips. Have fun rediscovering your memories. I'll see you in my next video.